Hey Capricorn, welcome to Good Witch Intuitive Tarot. This is your reading. This is a two-week reading. It's for the first two weeks of October. It's for Capricorn or anyone else who's guided to see the Capricorn reading. It could resonate right now or later on down the line. If you don't know what this reading's about, I say pay even closer attention. It could be something coming up that you're unaware of. This could resonate with anyone who's guided, even if you're a cross watcher, so welcome. This could be your reading as well. Anything could come out right to the very last second, and I can't stress that enough. Even after I click off camera, I could come back on with messages about the reading or about it, something totally unrelated. Capricorn reading for anyone who's guided. Spirit and angels. Anyone for the highest good. Growth, perseverance. Let's get another one. Can we get another one? Growth and perseverance. Whoa. All right. Let's take a look at it. You got two that came out in the upright. I'm going to put all these back because they're all face down and we only needed a couple. So you've got completion and you've got gossip. So this tells me that you've grown a lot. So growth and perseverance. So listen, you could have been the one who was very gossipy and you've grown from that experience or somebody else could have done this to you and you've grown from this experience. Let's look at it and see, but it's complete. There's something about a completion here. This is a lot of... um like internal growth let's take a look at, you know whether it's because of something someone did to you or because of some like you could just now gossip could be different things but it could be that you've grown a lot as well all right let's look at it oh i'm so sorry that was chakra wisdom oracle we're using chakra wisdom tarot we're using idols tarot and we're going all the way into the after tarot because this is a two-week reading all right so for Capricorn, what do we need to know? What are the messages? First two weeks of October for anyone who's guided. Capricorn reading could resonate now or it could resonate later on down the line. Capricorn reading for anyone who's guided. One more shuffle. Capricorn reading. All right. Growth, perseverance, completion, and gossip. Ah, four of cups, the sun, what else? We've got the nine of swords reversed, the wheel of fortune with the magician on it, which I really like. All right, we got the six of coins reversed. So you got a balance card next to an imbalance card. So that's interesting. We'll see what's going on. Can I get one more card here for Capricorn? Two, okay. All right, let's talk about it. So I can see where there has been some kind of drama going on. So whatever this gossip was, you could have dealt with other people, you know. Yeah, look. All right, so we're going to talk about that. Well, you got the Eight of Swords reversed. So you might have felt stuck in this, but there, this is releasing some for some reason. Now look. You've got a choice, two of wands, and you can stay in between all this, seven of swords, no, I'm sorry, five of swords and five of wands, or you can choose a different path. So this is interesting. So there's something here about releasing yourself, nine of swords. See how all these swords are about to stab her, but she, she knows she can't move or they're all going to get her. That's reversed. And also this, I feel so trapped, but it's reversed. So whatever is going on with all this drama, if you choose this other path, you're not in it anymore. So I don't know, you know, of course I always say this, don't leave a job if you don't have another one because you might not be able to pay your bills. But the cool thing about all that, now that I said that, is these two cards right here. We have the Four of Cups and see how her eyes are closed and she's just like taking some downtime, but there's a cup from the universe coming right at her the wheel is turning and see how the magician has manifested every single tool that they need to turn this wheel so this feels to me like you've been busy calling in a new job or a new situation so that you can leave this other thing that you felt so you could just work with a lot of the gossip card could just mean I work with a lot of crappy people and I can't wait to get out of there. You know, I can't wait to set myself free from it. You know, that's very possible. 
And we have the sun smack dab in the middle of the reading, which is very, you know, it's known as the happiest, best card in the deck. You know, and there it is, smack dab in the middle of your reading saying better times are here. I do feel like there's something good coming in. You have the Six of Pentacles here reversed. And if you look at the Six of Pentacles, look at all the hands coming at her. So in this particular deck, I don't mind it reversed. It almost feels better to me. But we're going to take a look at it because you also have here the the Princess of Coins reversed. She's reversed. She, he, they on everything. And I mean everything. Um, and we have the Seven of Swords here. So you know, either you might not see this offer coming yet, or you haven't told anybody about this offer yet. That's what I feel. All right, let's take a look at, or it hasn't come into you yet, because remember, Six of Pentacles isn't quite in yet. You know, maybe you're waiting for this, but I do see where you're about to be enlightened. You're about to see something. You've persevered. You're going to see growth. Um, you'll finally be able to complete this other gossipy thing that's been going on. Let's look at it. All right, spirit and angels, anyone for the highest good? What do we need to know? What are the messages? What do we need to know? What are the messages? Capricorn reading for anyone who's guided first two weeks of October or whenever it is resonating for you. Right, let's look at the sun smack dab in the middle of the reading. That is your central issue, the sunshine here in the middle. What do we need to know? What are the messages? Well, there it is. That's that offer, that Knight of Cups coming in with some kind of offer for you. This is what you're going to, I feel like you just haven't, you haven't seen this come through yet, but it's about to come through. Like there's something here about everything's lining up. Let's look at what's lining up. Four Cups, that's the cup coming in from the, this was brought to you courtesy of the universe. You have all the tools you need. You've been manifesting this like crazy. Four of Cups and the Wheel of Fortune. Tell us about this. What's causing this to happen? Four of Cups and the Wheel of Fortune. There it is. The Page of Wands and the Seven of Pentacles both came out on their side. So this really says to me that you've been waiting for some kind of message or you've been waiting for this information or you've been waiting for your instructions like your go time. I'm waiting to take action. I'm waiting for news. I'm waiting for information. These came out as a challenge. So this really says to me, you know, the you put you put in you planted these seeds and then you didn't hear anything or you're hoping you hear something and you haven't heard it yet. All right, let's look at this. Um I almost feel like these all are working together. Let's look at the, well, let's look at your Nine of Swords reverse. Tell me about the Nine of Swords reverse. What do we need to know? Capricorn reading. There it is again, the cup coming in. All right, so the cup's coming in, the cup's coming in, and the cup's coming in, and no more stress. I'm not stressed anymore. I see it. I see the cup coming in. I've waited, and now it comes in. I've waited. It was, oh, like, stressful while you waited, but now here it comes. Let's look at the Six of Coins reversed, the Princess of Coins reversed, and the Seven of Swords. What do we need to know? Six of Coins reversed, Princess of Coins reversed, and the Seven of Swords. What's important? There it is. All right, so you have the Six of Cups, and you also have the Ace of Coins reversed. Now, the any Ace in reverse for me is always, we got to figure out how to get it in, or it's a matter of time till it comes in. There's something about it coming in. I feel like you, this is what I feel. Okay, let's look at your bottom. You've got the Eight of Pentacles reversed. I feel this is where you work already. Like you already work somewhere with the Six of Cups here and the Eight of Pentacles reversed, but you wanna leave this place. This is like your past place that you're leaving. And this Ace of Pentacles is coming in and I feel like you're just, you either don't know that this is coming in or you're just not telling on anyone or both. Like you put in your, you put out your resume, you put in your applications, whatever, you've put the word out there that you want to switch jobs because this really feels job related for me. But this could be, um, this could be a relationship for some of you. If it is, it's that you're not going to put any effort into the past relationship anymore and you're being quiet and moving into a new one and you haven't told that person yet. 
because there's been some other offer that's come in. That's only going to be for a couple of you, though, because this really, really feels business and work and pentacle to me, this whole week. But I really feel for the majority of you, this is more about you're leaving this other thing behind, your new opportunity is coming in. Even if you don't know it yet, this is, thing's going to come in when you least expect it. Like, you're just minding your own business. You've been like, I've been waiting forever here, and Spirit's like, don't worry, we've got you, we've got it coming in. And you're about to see it. Like when you see this, you're going to be like, oh my gosh, it actually is coming in. I see it. And now I don't have to be all stressed out anymore. But it took a while and I started to get a little bit stressed out. But Spirit says, no, you. we've had this coming in for you. We heard the request. And you've been being really quiet at the job you're at until the new one comes in. And then you're going to leave it. For others of you, this is more about you just haven't seen it come in yet, but you're, it's it's on its way. It really is on its way. So if you haven't seen this yet, and if you haven't put yourself out there, please do. Because even at the bottom of the deck, we have the, eight, the Ten of Cups and the Ace of Cups. Ten of Cups and Ace of Cups really says to me, you're really going to, I feel like you're really going to like this. It's going to be so much happier than where you were. That's what I'm really seeing, that you deserve this. You've persevered through the drama and the gossip and the BS, but it, that's done. Like, you toughed it out. You've had a lot of growth. It's You've learned so much, but it's time for you to graduate from that. You did the work. You put in the time, you know, and you got through it. And we're going to send something new in for you. Please do comment down below, you guys. I'd love to hear from you. Let's get you a couple of after tarot here. And Capricorn, don't forget, hit that like. You could get more on my channel. I follow the likes to see who's getting what. If um, the highest liked videos get bonus readings, the highest liked videos get these two-week readings. Not everyone gets them. So please check out your monthly reading, which is going to be here at the end. And don't forget to like it because that's what I look at for these weekly readings. And for the weekly readings, I look at them for the bonus readings. These all just came right out. This is like, remember what I said? It's like you've graduated this. And Spirit's like, you know, you won. You win. The Chariot and the Six of Wands. This is a winner. And we're going to give you an option to go down a different path now, which is something we talked about in this whole reading. Going down this other path gets you out of the Seven of Swords and Five of Swords and all the drama with the gossipy people. You're going to have an option to go down another path, and it's being sent to you courtesy of the Divine. It's like Spirit sends you this option and they're saying don't miss this because we're going to we're going to light it up for you. It's going to come in in the way of this offer and it's going to get you out of all the stress that you've been under because it's a whole different atmosphere. Anyway, guys, please do like the video. It helps the channel. I appreciate you. Your monthly readings right up there. Okay? It should be popping up like right now. Anyway, good luck. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye.